You won't believe what you can make with a sublimation printer. We're gonna show you what we made right now. Hey, what's up? Do you like do-it-yourself projects? Do you like making things yourself? So do we. So join us each week for a new project. Go ahead and uh, hit the subscribe button. Tick that bell to be notified of our new ones that come out every week. This week, we're messing around with sublimation printing. We got a new toy off of eBay, so we decided to try it out. What's sublimation printing? We had no idea what it was either. So we did a bunch of research and bought a bunch of toys. All right, so sublimation printing is using heat transfer dye, sublimation dye. It reacts with polyester and PVCs to kind of embed the image inside of the polyester. It's like a heat transfer chemical reaction thing. Yep. This isn't a science class. This is a make it class. So it just embeds itself into these different polyester coatings. So there's two ways that you can get your materials to print on. There's one, you can buy it. They're called blanks. They have a bunch of different stuff. This one's a blank. It's aluminum coated in polyester. This one, we use some spray to coat it in a clear polyester that we found online. And we also coated this one in a clear polyester. This is just a regular tumbler. We're gonna see if the spray or the blank works better. And we also sprayed a t-shirt that's cotton with the polyester. And then we bought a polyester t-shirt and we're gonna see which one works better. Polyester cotton blend. Polyester 60 cotton 60% polyester. So we're gonna see how that works. The higher the ratio of polyester, the better it will take. So we found this printer on eBay. I picked it up for about 180 bucks. It took some tinkering. We had to clean it up, clean it out, and add a continuous ink system so that you can print large things and large quantities of things using the sublimation dye. We had to add this to our printer and there's fake printer heads in there. They just suck from these things. We printed out a couple of logos. We're gonna print the logos on things. And then we printed out a couple of pictures. Um, we're gonna try to put these on things and we're gonna see how they look, how they come out. All right, what are we trying first? What do you want to start with? Do you just want to go in for the aluminum and a picture? Right, yes. This was pre-purchased with sublimation coating on it. So yeah, I agree. Yes, we ordered a dozen, basically a dollar a blank, and they're pre-treated and everything. So let's peel the backing off. We got some high heat tape to hold it in place. What is going on here? I get some scissors. All right, I laid it face down. And when we did all of our prints, we printed everything mirrored. So our heat press is set at 375, and this thing said to press it at medium pressure. There you go. I'm gonna place this face down. All right, we ready to try it? Let's try it. All right. By the power of Grayskull! How are you counting 20 seconds? Oh, uh, I don't know how to get the timer to go. Start. Set. Five Mississippi, six Mississippi, seven Mississippi, 15 Mississippi, 16 Mississippi. <laughs> Let me get my foot. <laughs> 17 Mississippi, 92 Mississippi. Boop, 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 boop. All right, that's about 20, right? Yep. Uh. Woo. Woo wee. That seems hot. You sure you peel it off now? Don't you want to let it cool? Woo! No, they Ooh, said peel it off. Look at All right. that! That's what the paper looks like when we're done. It's really faded now. But man, you gotta check this out. This looks good! It does! That looks so good! Oh man, we're gonna be doing all kinds of stuff on this aluminum. I wonder if the wood's gonna look as good. Check it out! <sighs> looks pretty good, huh? <laughs> So I'm surprised how awesome that looks. That really does, it really does, it looks good. Ooh, that thing was hot. Take the wood, now we sprayed the wood with that stuff we got online. This uh, dye press, we sprayed it. You gotta mix it and then you spray it. Let it dry completely. Taking this picture, we're gonna put it on a piece of the wood. It's just a piece of scrap wood from the garage. I think this one we're gonna do face up. All right, let's see, 20 seconds again? Yep, I'll time <clears throat> this time, All right. like an actual timer. By the power of gray school. Ooh, wow. That's like high pressure. All right, it's high pressure. We're just going in high pressure. <laughs> high pressure. I guess I should have uh, loosened it up a little bit more. 20. Oop, stop. Okay, open that thing. Whoa, stop. All right, right here. Oh, oh well, uh, that didn't work. Maybe it needs to be longer. Didn't work. I don't think it was even. Didn't work. We're gonna put it back on. What? We put it right in the center, and we're in. Uh, we'll try 45 seconds. 
don't know. You know, we didn't even do any research on the wood. Not on like, the wood. He came up with that last minute. He threw that over here on this table, and I was like, what are we doing? Oop, it's it. smoking. Ah! All right, we ah! Out. We got a smoker. Popcorn. Why are you using your hands? Oh, well, it's not aluminum, and I don't want it to fall off the table. All right, let's see how it went. Not okay. Didn't work. We'll have to work on that one. That one sucked. All right. I don't know if we should put a piece of Teflon in the shirt. I don't know if it'll come. Oh, out on I the back. did hear. Yes, I did read that it might go all the way through. Yeah. To the back, if you don't put a Teflon sheet inside the shirt. All right. I mean, let's try that. We're gonna put a piece of Teflon in first. Okay, <clears throat> and then another sheet of Teflon. Yes. All right. How long? Twenty seconds. Sure. All right. Fifty eight seconds. Go. Just yep. Oh, oh wow, that, looks that looks good. good. Here, take it off. Okay. Wow, that came out really good. So I don't know if you can see. All right. I say we do a minute again. Ready? Yep. Okay. Go. All right. Minutes up. Ooh. Started burning it. Yeah, it still looks good though. The printing looks good, but I don't know if you can see at the top of the logo. I don't know if that's burnt or what. We swapped out the attachment for the cup attachment. We got this whole press thing for like $200 on Amazon. We can do plates, t-shirts, cups, hats, like four or five different sizes of cups or something. Mugs and Mugs, cups, yes. Uh -huh. Tumblers. This is a tumbler. I think you can pick them up for like three bucks. All right, the thing's hot. All right, I'll just put it on for a minute. Woo, Ooh, smoky. Wee. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Here's a Alright, maybe it didn't need to be 90 seconds. Yeah, that looks burnt. That's too long. Careful, is it hot? Okay, that wasn't good. Yeah, that was that was 45 seconds. It smells like fireworks. Oh not bad. Not bad. Okay. Eh. All right, the untreated cup that we left in for 90 seconds. And that's what the one that we sprayed looks like. We're gonna get some blanks and we're gonna try those, see what they look like. All right, that was it. I'd say we were about 50-50. Some of the stuff worked great, like the t-shirts worked out great. Yep. T-shirts worked out great. The aluminum came out amazing. I mean, the picture on it, it just looks awesome. It looks, it looks great. awesome. Uh, the lo we also did a logo on it. The logo came out great. So these were the purchased blanks. And then we tried to add polyester spray to the board. It didn't work, but we think that's because we didn't leave it in long enough. Yes. And then we tried one cup with the coating. Came out okay. Looks pretty good. And one cup we just tried off the shelf from Walmart. Looks like crap. <laughs> <laughs> Needs the coating. <laughs> we tried to spray in the cotton shirt with the coating. That came looks out great. great. Yeah, looks great. And we uh, tried a polyester blend and that came out great. All right, if you guys liked our project today, even though we had a couple of fails, why don't you go ahead and subscribe? Give us a like, a share, subscribe. Let us know what you want us to try for you next. We're down to try to do anything, build anything, make anything. Let us know down in the comments. Otherwise, we'll see you guys next week. See you next week.